and welcome to this beginner's guide to underwater photography. Whether you are an avid scuba diver or just enjoy swimming, capturing the beauty of the underwater world is a unique and rewarding experience. In this video, we'll cover some basic tips and tricks to help you get started with underwater photography. Before we dive into the tips, let's talk about gear. You will need a waterproof camera or a camera with an underwater housing. A good starting point for beginners is a point-and-shoot camera such as a GoPro. These cameras are compact and easy to use and many come with underwater modes. Additionally, you'll want to invest in some accessories such as a wrist strap or a buoyancy control device to keep your camera steady. Lighting is key to good underwater photography. As you descend, the colors in the water start to fade, making everything look blue and green. To counteract this, you can use a strobe or a flashlight to bring out the colors in your subject. If you are using a strobe, make sure to position it correctly to avoid backscatter, which is the unwanted reflection of light of particles in the water. The angle of your shot is important in underwater photography. Try shooting from different angles to get a unique perspective of your subject. For example, get low to the ground to shot up at a school of fish or get up close and personal with a turtle. The ocean is full of fascinating creatures and beautiful landscapes. Some of the best subjects for underwater photography include coral reefs, schools of fish, turtles and even sharks. Remember to always respect marine life and their habitat and never touch or disturb them. Before you start snapping away, it's important to understand the safety aspects of underwater photography. We'll discuss things like how to properly use your equipment underwater, how to avoid damage to the marine environment, and how to stay safe while you are shooting. Let's talk about camera settings. Underwater photography requires some adjustments to your camera settings, such as aperture and shutter speed. Experiment with different settings to see what works best for your particular camera and subject. Additionally, make sure to review your photos after each dive to learn from your mistakes and improve your technique. Finally, we'll talk about editing your underwater photos. Even the best photographers need to edit the images to make them truly stand out. And we'll go over some basic editing techniques that can take your underwater photography to the next level. Underwater photography can be challenging, but it's also incredibly rewarding. With the light equipment, techniques, and safety measures in place, you can capture stunning images of the underwater world that few people ever get to see. We hope this comprehensive guide has given you the information you need to get started, and we wish you the best of luck on your underwater photography journey.